Well, this one is for all the hair gurus out there. National Hair Day is coming up this week on October 1st, and Maya Turner reports one coastal hairstylist is taking her talents all the way to New York for Fashion Week. I've wanted to do hair since I was super little. Um, I think that had a lot to do with having a cleft lip when I was born. Um, I definitely wanted to make people feel beautiful inside and out. Erin Burgess, owner of Brushes Salon in Gulfport, went to cosmetology school directly out of high school, knowing that her passion was hair. Upon graduation, she immediately went into a salon. But owning her own shop was the dream, and six years ago, the time was finally right. I've, I've always wanted to just create an aesthetically pleasing place where really awesome, colorful, creative people could come together and make pretty hair, and I feel like we definitely do that here. And now, Burgess is taking the curlers and hair color to New York, styling in one of the world's four major fashion weeks. A few years back at a hair show, uh, we made a friend, Alyssa Blair Addison. She had recently reached out asking me if uh, that would be something I'd be interested in, and then, yeah, she hand-selected a team together, and. I'm just grateful she asked me. And the best part about being a stylist is the impact her entire shop makes on everyone who walks in and out of their doors. Oh, I love just seeing the inner confidence, uh, the glow, I call it. It's like they, they can come in pretty dim. I mean, you know, and, and I'm not talking about just their appearance, just it could be sadness, it could be anything, because this isn't just about, you know, doing hair, it's therapy. That's what I call it. Um, <laughs> They come in, they may be feeling a little off or want to feel better about themselves. And then between the color, the conversation, the new haircut, by the end of it, they're literally, I feel like, glowing at our door. So that's, I mean, my last name was Glisten, so, you know, you got to make them shine. <laughs> Burgess says she can't wait to share more about her shop and the talented women who work there in New York and bring back what she learned to the coast. Styling alongside photojournalist Michael Rogers, I'm Maya Turner for WLOX News Now.